Now, let's talk about what's in store for messages. Hundreds of millions of people rely on messages every single day. It's integral to how we communicate with the people who matter most. And now we're adding three of the most highly requested features to messages. First, have you ever sent a message only to immediately realize you didn't quite say what you intended? Well, no worries, because now you can edit any message you just sent. So embarrassing typos can be a thing of the past. Second, have you ever wished you'd never sent that message at all? Well, good news, now you have undo send. So you can immediately recall a recent misfire. And finally, you can now mark any thread as unread, a perfect tool if you don't have time to respond in the moment and wanna be sure to come back to a message later. These three features are going to make a big difference in how you use messages every single day. Messages makes texting easy and efficient, and it's also a great way to share. Last year, we introduced Shared With You, which takes things like photos, links, and music that your friends share with you in messages and highlights them right in the app where you'd like to enjoy them later. And for developers, we're really excited to make Shared With You available with a new API. So when someone sends you a funny video, a worthwhile article, or a recipe that you don't have time to check out in the moment, it'll be there waiting for you the next time you open that app. And when it comes to sharing in real time with others, people are loving SharePlay. It's stellar for enjoying shared experiences while connecting over FaceTime, like watching TV shows, listening to music, or breaking a sweat to a synced up workout. So many of your favorite apps are using SharePlay to create shared experiences, like listening to bedtime stories together with better sleep, or playing a rowdy game of heads up no matter how far apart you are. And this year, we're making it easier to discover all of these awesome SharePlay experiences from within your FaceTime call. With just a tap, you can jump into SharePlay supported apps that you already have on your phone, or discover new experiences that you can share with your friends. And to give you more opportunities to enjoy shared experiences, we're extending SharePlay beyond FaceTime and bringing it to messages. This was the number one request from developers. Now, when you find something you want to share, like a movie on Disney+, Plus, you can kick off SharePlay right there and enjoy it together while chatting in messages. You can watch in sync, and you've got the same instantaneous shared playback controls that make SharePlay magical. So whether you're using SharePlay for your weekly movie night or marking a message unread so you can respond later, Messages has everything you need to connect with ease. And we're making it that much easier to compose messages with some updates to dictation. To tell you more, here's Robbie. Dictation lets you type just by speaking and can be much faster than typing with the keyboard. This is why it's so popular for taking notes, sending messages, and more. In fact, dictation is used over 18 billion times each month, and it's designed to protect your privacy. Thanks to the neural engine, dictation can happen entirely on device. Today, we're excited to introduce an all-new on-device dictation experience that lets you fluidly move between voice and touch. Let's take a look. We'll use our new dictation experience to send an email. Now, when I start dictating, the keyboard stays open so I can switch between using voice and touch. I can even select text using touch and replace it with my voice just by speaking. Are you sending a longer message? Dictation automatically adds punctuation to the text. That's so cool. Mind blown emoji. Automatic punctuation and emoji dictation also work when you send messages with Siri.